Hi, I'm Judy Lynn and this is your Monday Morning Shift. Today is Memorial Day and I want to start out by honoring all of our men and women who are formally or currently in the armed forces and I want to honor their families too. All of them are making such huge sacrifices for all of us to continue life as we know it. So thank you. For those of you who've lost loved ones in the service, a thank you just isn't enough for the sacrifice that you continue to endure on a daily basis. My heart goes out to you. Then we have the thousands more who are physically and or emotionally broken because of what they've had to do and what they have seen. And this is beyond our imagination. To the men and women with post-traumatic stress and their families who suffer in their struggle to make it better for them, this video is for you. I know the pain. I've had loved ones with post-traumatic stress. I'm married to a Vietnam vet who was not honored when he came home. I've seen the pain and I know the residual damage that it causes in their lives and the lives of their families. I've worked with a few vets and there are a few common beliefs and emotions that I found that many, many, many of them share. Each is unique, of course, and has specific memories and traumas to address, but there is some common uh, shared emotions and beliefs. And we're gonna do some tapping on some of those issues today. So, if you are fortunate enough not to have this experience, please pass this video on to someone who might benefit. And remember, this is just a general tapping experience. If you have post-traumatic stress disorder, please see a professional EFT practitioner who's experienced in post-traumatic stress and work with them. It's a powerful technique that can help you quicker than any other method I've ever seen. So I want you to start with the karate chop point and I want you to repeat after me. All right. Even though I've seen some horrific things, I accept who I am and how I feel. Even though I've done things people wouldn't understand, I accept how I feel and love myself anyway. Even though I can't get these images out of my head, day and night they haunt me. I love myself completely and I honor how I feel. Now we're going to go to the eyebrow point and I will tell you where to move from point to point as we move on from here. So just tap on the eyebrow either side or both of the face and body. This anxious feeling in me, it consumes me day and night, side of the eye. I've seen and done so much, but I feel I haven't done enough under the eye. I want to escape, but I can't get away from me, from the memories. I can't undo any of it. Under the nose, part of me is proud and part of me is filled with shame. Chin point, I've learned to hate. This hate protects me. It validates me. And it's also fuel for the anxiety in me. Collarbone. It runs through my body. I don't know how to turn it off. Under the arm. I haven't done enough. I should do more. Wrist together. I wonder if it's possible to let this go. Top of the head. It doesn't seem possible at all. It feels overwhelming and all-consuming. Back to the eyebrow. I lost so much. I lost me. 
I don't know who I am anymore. Side of the eye, this pain. I can't undo what has happened. I wonder if it's possible to let go of these emotions around this. Under the eye, I'm open to the possibility that I did my best. I was doing my job. Under the nose, much of it wasn't my choice. I did all I could do. I followed orders and I survived. Chin point. I'm open to the possibility that it's safe to let this go. Collarbone. It's safe to let this go. Releasing the guilt because I survived and others didn't. Under the arm. It's safe now. It's safe to sleep. I'm safe now. Wrists together, or top of the head, I'm sorry. Releasing this fear in me. Releasing this anxious feeling. This need to do something. Now just tap your wrists together. It's safe to be me. It's safe to feel peaceful. It's safe right now. Thank you for joining me in this special tribute to our vets and servicemen and women and their families. Remember, get some professional help if you suffer or someone you know suffers with post-traumatic stress. And I'd love to have you hop on over to my website and sign up for my Monday Morning Shift newsletter, where you'll receive a free tapping video each week right in your inbox, along with some pretty helpful tips on how to live the best life you can, a vibrant life of purpose. I'll also give you a free downloadable tapping ebook just for joining us. Keep tapping, you guys. Move that old stuck energy that no longer serves you and go out there and make it your own.